Hello, Fenville family. We have been asked to put together a video with some things that you guys can do for football or basketball or softball or just things you can do at home with no equipment to stay in shape. So we put a video together and uh, Mr. Potts and the middle school staff is doing a great job editing, editing the videos and uh, hopefully you'll like this and you'll find it useful. Take care. Okay, for this one we're going to do our warm up stuff. This is butt kickers. Go ahead guys. Try and get your heel as far up and your knee back as you're doing it. Stretches out the front of your leg. Your quadriceps. Okay, our next stretch is karaoke. And the trick to these is to sweep your front knee high when it comes through the front of your body. And also to take little steps. Go ahead, Tony. Go ahead, Joel. Good. Short, choppy steps run into the side. Okay, the next one is walking knee pull to a lunge. Go ahead, guys. Really pull your knee high, get a good stretch, and then you just drop your foot down into a lunge, and then you do the other leg. Pull it up high, then stretch it out, do a lunge. One more. The next one we're going to do is touching on either side of the feet. Go ahead, guys. Walk when you do this. There you go. Try and stay down a little longer if you can stay down and squeeze it. Stretches the back of your legs or your hamstrings. Okay, these are horizontal pull-ups and it's done with a canoe rack from the top of my truck. Make sure whatever you use is sturdy enough that it will not break when you pull on it and it won't fall from the area that you have it on. I've got it on a set of four tires on one side and my workbench on the other side. Tony's going to do horizontal pull-ups. Put your feet on a box or something so that when you're straight at the bottom with your arms fully extended, you're almost parallel to the ground. All right, Tony, go ahead. Pull up, get up high enough that your chest almost hits the bar and control yourself on the way down. Joel, hop in here and do some. Joel has to adjust the box a little bit because he's shorter than Tony is, but not as short as I am. All right, pull all the way up, Joel. Get all the way up, there you go. Job. Okay, these are vertical jumps. Just stand in one spot, vertically jump, get your balance and your feet back under you again, and then go again. All right, guys, go ahead. Use your arms, reset your feet, get as high as you can. Good. You can do like six or eight of those each time you do them. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is jump lunge switch. And that's pretty self-explanatory. Go ahead, guys. Get all the way down every time, as low as you can, jump and switch feet. Okay, these are three-way lunges. And the first one is straight forward. Okay, Tony, go ahead. Okay, all the way down, all the way back to where you started. The second point is 45 degrees. Back where you started. The third point in three-way lunges is straight sideways. Getting all the way down, then back up. You're going to want to do three to six with each leg and then switch legs and do the other leg after you take a little bit of a break. If you okay, need. these are going to be command push-ups. So you can work with each other and either person can give the command down and then up. And the time variation should be variable. Okay, go ahead, guys. On my command, down, up, down, up. Down, up, down, up, tougher. Okay, these are regular push-ups, which everybody's done. Okay, go ahead, guys. Full range of motion. We're going to demonstrate like four or five of them for you. Back is straight like a plank. Okay, we're going to start some ab exercises. These are called scissor kicks. You want to keep your legs almost straight and... 
The top is where your toe is rough, roughly even with your belly button, and you want to bring your heel on your other leg down almost to, its, to the point where it's touching the ground. All right, go ahead, guys. These are scissor kicks. Here we go. Oh, good. What we're going to do is, is uh, bicycles. Go ahead, guys. Full range of motion, just like you're doing, like you would uh, be doing if you were riding a bike. Same exact thing. Really point your toe. Okay, next thing is regular crunches. So go ahead and put your knees up. Okay, get the bottom of your shoulder blades off the ground. Go ahead, Joel. Good. Uh, last one we're going to do is 45 degree sit-ups. Okay, one leg up 45 degree and the other one straight. Okay, go ahead, guys. Again, the bottom of your shoulder blade should be off the ground. Switch legs.